My name is Jeremy. I'm a product marketer here at New Relic. Today, I'll be showing you how easy it is to get up and running with our new tail-based tracing capability, New Relic Edge with Infinite Tracing. Enabling Infinite Tracing is a really simple two-step process. The first thing you do is provision a trace observer. This can be done using our NerdGraph API Explorer. You can simply just copy the query that's provided on our docs page and paste that into the middle section of NerdGraph, making sure to update the account ID. Execute the query and you'll see the trace observer information appear in the right hand pane. The second step is to configure your agents to send trace data to the trace observer. Here you can see a screenshot that highlights the new environment variable in a Docker service configuration. Within minutes, traces will appear showing the complete behavior of your distributed system. From the distributed tracing user interface, you can quickly see traces exhibiting interesting behavior. For example, here you can see a trace with one anomalous span that seems to be running unusually slow. And you can also see two services that contain errors, the web portal and the promo service. You can dive deeper into each of these issues to view the error details and get the information you need to pinpoint exactly what's happening. Troubleshooting distributed systems is a proverbial needle in a haystack problem. New Relic Edge with Infinite Tracing automatically eliminates the noise and focuses on errors or long-running traces, so you can quickly find and resolve issues. To learn more or get started using our new fully managed service, you can visit our website or refer to our docs for more information.